In this video, we're going to be drafting a team and then trying to start off undefeated with the team. Hopefully going to be getting a 12-0 team earlier today in the first video of the day. We went for 12 wins. Tried to secure a diamond reward worth over 100,000 stubs. So if you guys missed that, be sure to check it out. Feel free to follow on any of those social medias. Leave a like. Go in for 512 or more likes on this video. Subscribe if y'all are new on the road to 53 thousand subscribers if we hit that before may 1st we're giving away 250 dollars 50 of that no matter what no matter how much the giveaway is it's going to be going to channel members only feel free to comment anything down below real quick before we hop into this a couple things i want to say number one i now have a control freak code i feel like they truly do help me out with hitting the only ones i've ever used are vortex i'm using the shorter vortex on my left analog stick the one i use to move the pci code twin t-w-i-n i actually have some more coming in the mail i'm trying out the galaxy the omni and the cqc so whenever i get those i'll definitely do you know a more in-depth review explanation everything like that but if you've been thinking about getting some control freaks to try to up your mlb game feel free to use my discount code twin and then second thing the more i would say more important thing honestly is i just want to thank you guys again first of all specifically for 52,000 subscribers i truly appreciate you guys thank you so much for 52,000. the support recently and just every single day has been insane and just thank you guys overall for the support subscribing leaving a like comments kind messages twitter psn instagram uh just viewing the videos in general like whatever it may be i truly do appreciate it i i, I just i feel like i can't thank you guys enough and i feel like you guys will never understand like how much better and how much happier it makes me just seeing your support every single day so thank you so much for just all of that and all the support i really appreciate you guys i don't really know what exactly we're gonna do oh yo i gotta draft this card i have to try out this new alec bohm honestly out of these four guys i feel like alec bohm might be the one that i would normally choose too because i suck with raleigh fingers for actually i'm not that bad but um i just I, I, my pitching is bad enough with dime with, with anybody like is you know Alec Bohm is the move I, 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 I can't talk today Alec Bohm's the move um Grandy's gonna be a pinch hitter for me Eric Thames is gonna be a pinch hitter for me you guys have been telling me that I should use my common rounds on starting pitchers so because I, a lot of times don't use the other one so we're gonna try that out today let me know who y'all would choose here would you guys go the diamond hitting John Olrude? Would you guys go the fireballing Rob Nen? Or would you guys go the switch hitting Adley Rutschman? I'm going to go Adley here. I have not used this card. Oh, I actually have not used this card, and I kind of want to try him out. There we go. Okay. Um. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Use Meryl Petit. I have not allowed an earned run with him in Battle Royale. So I'm going to just grab him as a righty reliever. Try to keep that going. Michael Givens. I really like him. Even though I don't do great with him. I've had some rough games that have kind of in inflated that ERA a little bit. There's the second common round. Second starting pitcher. Vida Blue is a Battle Royale goon as a lefty. Um, Luis Robert. For some reason, I don't know why, but somebody told me it was Luis Robert. And I was pronouncing it like that. Uh, and then I watched some press conference where he was pronouncing his own name. And I'm pretty sure he said Robert. I'm pretty sure you guys were telling me it's Robert. So we're going to go Luis and uh, and get him right there. Correa has a glitchy swing, man. Let me know who y'all would choose here. Would you go the diamond switch hitting contact hitter? Wade Boggs, the contact hitter. Try to rely on him to get on base. Would y'all do one of these two? Or would you go Correa, who has a glitchy swing? Let me move this up a little bit too. I feel like Correa is the move um for me personally i thought that was uh i saw the dodger i saw silver i thought it was jack peterson man gavin lux i haven't used this card wait i forgot he was from wisconsin I, rem I remember my brother telling me about that now yo wisco gang stand up baby uh pedro strope has been good for me in br luke voigt's been good for me in br i think i'm gonna go strope man i want one more righty that's my last righty we're gonna get there edwin Encarnacion. i love edwin there we go, man. Huge first baseman. Um, DJ LeMayhew, that's Battle Royale right there. He's been good. Brad Hand could be a decent reliever. Let's go DJ LeMayhew, though. Yeah, let's get DJ LeMayhew right there. I, I like that pick. That's okay with me. Willie Calhoun is insane, especially as a pinch hitter, if that's the case. Um, Dylan Floro looks honestly like a good righty. I'm going to grab him as my final righty. Miguel Snow yo i don't know i think we should be able to find a spot for him i'm pretty sure we should be able to okay um mike minor i like mike minor but i also have struggled with him i feel like he could be good for the team rod carew 
Ramon Laureano may be in the outfield. I'm going to go Mike Miner. Maybe that's stupid, but I want Mike Miner there. That's just what my gut's telling me. Um, let's get a switch hitter off the bench. I'm looking for lefty relievers right now is kind of what I'm, what I'm trying to find. Uh, or a lefty reliever is what I'm looking for right now. Bronze one. So let's just go. Let's get a backup catcher just in case. Uh, we're going to get Cole Hamels as a starting pitcher. We're going to do Mike Soroka as a starting pitcher. And we're going to do Lance McCullers Jr. as a starting pitcher. Babe Ruth off the bench. Maybe a glitchy swing. Amir Garrett, the lefty. That's perfect. Yo, I feel like this is actually not a bad team. I honestly feel like it's not. If you guys want to take a look at all the players we have again, uh, maybe you skip through the draft or something. I'm just going to show you guys the bullpen rotation, lineup, and bench. Obviously, I'm going to be putting at least one or two of these guys on the team, but that's what we have so far. Feel free to pause it on any, any of those. We're going to try to start off 1-0 right now. My bad if the draft was kind of long. I just had a, a lot of, I feel like, hard choices to make for some of those rounds. Look at this card. That's insane. For a third baseman that can also play first base with that hitting and that vision, I feel like if I get this card, he will actually make it onto my ranked seasons team, especially with that hitting. Maybe I'll stick him at first base or something, but wow, that's a disgusting card. If you guys are wondering how to get this card, he's actually the 50 win reward in the current event that's going on. We're playing the Montreal Bird, Doge, or Pona has Jeb McNeil, Jose Ramirez, Buster Posey, Jock Fernando, Luke Voigt, Hunter Renfro, Kevin Ryan Yarbrough on the mound. Should be good for Alec Bohm in his first at bat. We got Soroka on the mound, home team, trying to be 1-0. Yo, Bird Doge, I appreciate it, man. Shout out to you if you're watching this video. Hopefully you enjoy seeing yourself in it. Good luck in this game, and thank you so much for the kind words. I really appreciate that. And 2-2 two and two count. That's going to be a leadoff base hit. Oh, wait. Who do I have in center field? Oh, I for, my outfield's trash, guys. That actually might not be good. I have Willie Calhoun out there in center. I think that's going to be a bad move of his uh, button accuracy is that small as we give up a two-run home run. Here in the top of the first inning. There we go. Buster Posey grounding out following the home run. Let's try to get a 1-2-3 inning following the home run. And then just do our best to try to tie it in the bottom half at least. I pitched to Jock Peterson for no reason. It ended up working out. Okay, if I throw to the cutoff man with Calhoun, it's not going to be bad actually. I just need to make sure I'm only throwing to the cutoff man. Because otherwise, it's going to be a little bit too tiny to hit. Tatis, 0-2 count. I thought I was done giving up 0-2 base hits. What am I doing? Daniel Murphy should be the final out. There we go. On our way to the bottom of the first inning. Let's try to get at least one run. Preferably tie it, though. No, I struck out with Adley Rushman, man. Chasing that curve in the dirt. And ball four to Edwin. Okay, Alec Bohm. Is it Bohm or Bomb? Because I hear some people say bomb. I hear some people say boom. I've always said boom, but I actually don't know. I would love a home run for him here. My first ever game with this card. And he hits it well. Misses it a little bit, though. Dang, man. Got the pitch to hit. 1-0 count. Disappointed in myself for that. Hopefully, we can get another at-bat with him here in this game, though. No, dude. Okay. I struck out twice in one inning. There's a games where, like, most Battle Royale games, I don't even strike out once. So, that was just not a great inning for me on the mound. and or, It wasn't a great inning for me on the mound in the first, but uh, it wasn't a great inning at the plate. We got to focus up. I know I'm better than that. I know I can take more pitches, wait for hittable pitches, and I think we're going to have a way better bottom of the second as long as we focus up. Oh, no. Ball four. I can't be walking, guys. Not good, not good, not good. Kevin Kiermaier coming up. Let's try to get a double play after that leadoff walk. He's stealing and bunting. Oh, perfect bunt. What? Yo! And then Grandy. Okay, I, I can't throw home, can I? No, dude, that, this is to the cutoff right here. That one's to the cutoff and is that small. I got my work cut out for me this game. There's still nobody down, too. Uh-oh. Jeff McNeil. Dang, it's going to score another run, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, easily scoring that run. Jose Ramirez striking out for round number two. I got to score some in the bottom. No matter, even if we allow more runs in this inning, I need to score in the bottom of the second. As Buster Posey up the middle extends the inning. Reese Hoskins pinch hitting for Jock Peterson. On our way to the bottom of the second, down by four. I have to score here. 
I cannot be losing by four or more in the bottom of the third. That's just way too much to be down by. Also, my bad. I don't think the cam was on for the first inning and a half of this game. So I'm sorry if that's the case. I didn't even realize. Three and two to Sano. I strike out, man. I, I was expecting an off-speed low and not the fastball right there. Correa, ball four. A home run cuts the lead in half, Willie. This is why we have you in center field for your bat. That's exactly why we have him. Oh, wait, no, it's... Oh, early. And ball four to Willie. Back-to-back -back walks. Two on, one down for DJ LeMayhew. DJ LeMayhew up the middle. No, 97 off the bat. Just straight to that shortstop on the slider down the middle. Shoot. All right, guys, down to my final three ounce in this game, potentially with this team. You know, if we start off 0-1... Usually there's no points in continuing the run just because if you get to 12 wins anyways, that means you won 12 in a row, so you might as well have almost drafted another team. Kind of disappointing start to the game. I thought we had something cooking there in the, uh, look at Alec making the play. I thought we had something cooking there in the bottom of the second inning, got on top of that slider, and we're going to do our best to not allow any more runs and then at least tie it in the bottom of the third, really try to focus up. Just take it one pitch at a time. Mike Miner on the mound. He's done well for me so far. Looking to keep it going. Okay. You know, if you throw pitches down the middle, you're probably going to give up some base hits. That's what happened right there. And it's a one-out double for Daniel Murphy. Oh, that's a good pitch. Come on, Alec. Come on, Alec. Knock it down. Way to knock it down, kid. There we go. Making the play. Out number two. And Kevin Kiermeyer drives in a run. Dang, that one... That just kept going. I thought it was going to kind of, you know, just drop in. Or I, I don't know what I thought it was going to do, but I, I didn't think it was going to do that. As that is a uh, an RBI triple. Austin Hayes, pinch hitter. Hit it well. Straight to that left fielder. On our way to the bottom of the third. I don't have a hit yet, do we? Wait, yeah, I don't have a hit yet. Oh, my goodness. Bruh. <laughs> this has been a bad game. All right, Grandy, show why we got you as a pinch hitter. This has not been a great game. Down by five, being out hit 8-0. Going to do our best to come back, hopefully. Grandy pitch down the middle. Missing that one a little bit, man. Dang. Out number one to lead off the bottom of the third. Adley Rushman, that's good. All right, guys, we needed to take it one hitter, one pitch, one batter at a time. That's going to be a double for Adley. Edwin Encarnacion with the base hit now. That's big. I'm not going to send the runner uh, because, you know, that run's not important. And he would only be on third base anyways as it's 5-1. to one. Alec coming up, looking to be 1-2 for two in my first ever game with this card. Alec, we missed it, man. Ooh, that's out number two. I missed that pitch. Oh, I've been missing pitches that I shouldn't be missing today. Eric Thames, that's going to do it. Yo, Birdos, GG's to you, man. Shout it's not over. Hey, let's just hit a home run here, Miguel. Let's just hit a home run, cut the lead to one. How about that? Miguel Sano actually does it. Wow. A home run ties it now with two down. Uh, yo, can we tie the game? Can we actually tie it here, please, team? Oh, my goodness. We got Correa up. <gasps> this is a perfect opportunity. And we chase it. Yeah, man. That would have been ball four. Hey, Birdos, GG's to you, man. We're starting off 0-1 with this team. That's probably going to be it for this team, if I'm going to be honest. Alec Bohm, 0 for 2 with him, sadly. Looks like a good card, but I wasn't able to do anything with him here in this game. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment anything down below. My bad for losing, but the good news is we lost super early on, right? So that means we'll be able to draft another team, hopefully get far with that team. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Peace out.